Today's episode is brought to you by Curiosity Stream. Get access to 2,400 of the best top documentaries and nonfiction series by signing up at curiositystream.com slash rogue. Get a whole month for free. You're welcome. All right, Jason Murphy, I want to take a whole bunch of fireworks and light one fuse and get a whole bunch of them to go off at the same time. I've made fuses before with Grant Thompson, the King of Random. No way! What? No way! Even while it's wet! If I remember correctly, we took the same fuel that we made smoke smoke bombs out of. Holy sh! I didn't expect that. Holy sh! And basically just coated it over a piece of string, right? Essentially, yeah. You're not just coating it in the string. You're actually letting the string absorb the potassium nitrate and the sugar. Right. Now, the uh, sugar slows down the burn, right? So these will be slow burn fuses. And we're going to use this in our project so that we can... What was that sound? Oh, God. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> 36 grams of potassium nitrate in this spectricide stump remover that you can get at most hardware stores. And then we'll combine it with what, sugar? With sugar, we're gonna use 24 grams All right, so of sugar. So just 60 grams total. And if I remember correctly, we have, we've already preheated this. Do we have a spatula or something? Well, first we wanna shake that up real good to make sure it's completely mixed. We're gonna take about a third cup of water. Yeah. I'm gonna pour it in here. Yeah. Okay, so here. You got the stir, mix us around. Okay. This is also one that you don't want it to get too hot too fast. Yeah, exactly. We're gonna cook this for a bit until the water starts to evaporate off. We're gonna know that it's evaporated because the uh, water starts to get all frothy and bubbly. And if I remember correctly, it's like a, a creamy, peanut buttery kind of texture, right? Right, uh, but we're not really gonna let it get to that. Oh, oh. Yeah, because we put that water in there and we don't want it to get uh, all creamy and peanut buttery because then it won't soak into the string. Oh, this is looking good. Yeah. I'll bet, I bet we're fully saturated here, right? I think this is about as good as it's gonna get. Yeah, okay, well here, let's, let's throw the foil on there. All right. And then we'll lay out these strips. Do we want to now nest these together to create a mega fuse so that you light one fuse and it just goes out and out and out and out? Let's do that, yeah. Okay. Yeah. You can kind of tell that we only have a limited window to manipulate these before they all harden. Before they get crusty and hard? Yeah. Yeah. Oh, so you're not even tying them. You're just twisting them? Yeah, yeah. Well, because once this dries, they, they all kind of conglomerate together. Yeah. So we're making, making like a giant lightning bolt, basically. Looks pretty good. Yeah. Okay, so we let them dry. Yeah, I guess uh, time. Cause time to pass and activate spell. All right, so it took what, like 24 hours for them to dry and then another two weeks for us to find time to shoot the rest of this. Yeah, something like that. <laughs> what we've got here, I think, are going to be some remarkably effective potassium nitrate fuses. All right, here, I'm gonna move these over to on this side. I'm gonna, I'm gonna pull out the fire extinguisher. Okay. Oh, that's fast. See, it's not super fast, but... Also oh, not super reliable. Not super reliable. This is... Oh. Uh, yeah. Oh. This could happen. Oh. But it's gonna keep... It, it doesn't look like it quite stops. It keeps on going. Maybe I didn't get it hot enough to begin with? No. Maybe we didn't get it even enough. And I don't know if this crust around here is sugar or potassium nitrate. Uh, I'm honestly not sure. So maybe that was, it seems to be consistent. Yeah, it might not have been mixed well enough. Remember how we were having trouble getting it to heat evenly? So we got like some that are good, some that are having issues? Yeah. That's not bad, man. It's not bad. That looks like an improvised legitimate fuse to me. It could be better. So since it's 4th of July, I got some of these uh, Roman candles. Maybe we just kind of loop this on. That should work, right? And wrap it around. Should we duct tape it on there too? Could it hurt? I'd be more worried about it burning and not igniting the other one because it doesn't have enough, uh, I don't know, fire full juice. Fire juice, that's the yep. thing. <laughs> Everybody who is enjoying me looking like a pro during the fire eating episode is like, ah, that's the Brian we know. <laughs> fire juice. <laughs> you know you know how to, to do, you just hold it straight up, right? Oh, it says do not hold in hand. 
Since when? Where are you supposed to, how are you supposed to hold this? Since when? What are you, are, 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 are they serious that, I thought this was America. For outdoor, bury tube halfway in sand or soil. Like we're in Nam. And point away from flammable, yeah. okay. I'm holding it, you want okay. me to hold it? Yeah, 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 yeah you do you. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> all right, just, just make sure it stays pointed. Uh, again, you gotta really get that thing started. Otherwise, it, give, it, give it another. Okay. Ooh, it's taking its time on that one. Come on. Oh no, did we make bad fuses? Is this God's way of telling me, hey, don't hold the Roman candle at all? Certainly don't hold it towards the cameras. <laughs> <laughs> Come on. Oh, maybe it's just a one bad fuse. I mean, technically, okay, we're still we're still in the Well now the real up, one up, is up, lit. Up. Okay, uh. I'm starting to think we shouldn't be holding this in our hands. I'm starting to think that this feels a lot like poor man's Iwo Jima. Uh, I'm not feeling real good about how that went down. No, me neither. Mm. I'm feeling like our fuses are fairly inconsistent. Yeah. Here's the only one I care about, is whether the, the, hydra? the Mecha Hydra is going to work. We have 10 little tendrils on the end, and we have seven of the big ones left I say we just try to get this one hooked up. Yeah. And, 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 and make you a mega go for fuse. Broke? Yeah. If, if, let's see how many of the seven we could get to ignite with our, our, our crappy fuses. Okay, so we're going to make a big old Yosemite Sam TNT thing. <laughs> Here's what we'll do first, we'll tape it down. And then I'll tell you what, why don't you gather a bunch of rocks for us to make a little pyramid around it? All right. We'll, we'll essentially do what the instructions say and bury it. Yeah. Does that feel secure enough to you? Oh yeah. No, that's not gonna go anywhere. You haven't even touched it. <laughs> it's no, like I mean, a, look at it. I saw you moving. It's not okay. going anywhere. All right, all right. So then now, I guess we take what we need. These tendrils. You want to start tying these around? Here, you hold it alongside it, and I'll go ahead and. Here we go. Okay, you're hoping for three? Yeah. I'm expecting two. Really? Yeah. This seems secure. These seem attached. This seems like a lot of fused material. Man, the word seem is doing a lot of work today. <laughs> I, I mean, I think at this point we just go for it, right? You're betting two, I'm hoping for three. I'm hoping for seven. I'm betting on two. You grab this. Yeah. I'll grab, I'm just gonna light it, what, right here in the middle? Sure. Where are we gonna go? <laughs> you, you want to stand back here to watch? Well, I don't think we need to get that far, but uh, yeah, we'll just take a few steps back, should be fine. Whip, 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 whip. That's one, we got one. That's, that seems like two, we got two. That seems like, like maybe three. Four, four. No way. Did we get all of them? Dude! Holy shit! Did that work? I, I think it got all of them. This is where we, we very carefully approached. It got all of them. Dude, it did. All seven of them. Okay, so why did that work? I don't think each individual fuse was very trustworthy. Right. But I think bundling them all together brought enough heat down that by the time it got to the bottom, just everything was all fired yeah. up. We had so much fuse here. If you look right over here, a bunch of it fell off while it was still burning. It right. was coming over here. So a bunch of it while it was still burning, I think also fell down onto the actual fuses. So even if it didn't work, we had some redundancy built. Yeah, yeah. It's, it's almost like we did. We had a redundant array of independent fuses. A rafe. <laughs> a rafe. There you go. Man, I'm going to say we did a fine job. I think that was Homemade surprisingly fuses, successful. Homemade uh, fuses, legend tested. They work, kind of. Boom. Brian, I need some good documentaries. Documentaries. How do you feel about nonfiction series? I love nonfiction series. As long as it's not like the secret of Egypt is. 
Aliens. First of all, it might actually be aliens. Did might you ever be. think about that? Possibly. Second of all, what if I told you there's a streaming service created by the founder of the original Discovery Channel with 2,400 of the best non-fiction series and documentary films from top quality talent. Everyone from David Attenborough to Sigourney Weaver to Michio Kaku. And what if I told you you could get access to all of it on most devices for only $2.99 per month. Don't talk, because I know what you're about to say is where do I sign up? You don't sign up yet because you get a whole month free by going to curiositystream.com slash rogue, plug in, learn all the knowledge in the world. You're welcome. Also, it was totally aliens. $2.99? $2.99. Okay. This is gonna look an awful lot like something we did before, but it's not the thing we did before. It's not. I we... just touched the hot plate. It's oh, hot. It's are you hot. okay? That's very hot. Yeah. yeah. It's 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 more. You see, the light doesn't come on, so how are you supposed to know? Uh, I mean, aside from the fact that I told you the, a couple of times. Well, and the heat. And, yeah. <laughs>